Anyway, this is just a quick vid to show you how to put together indirect evap cooling with my Blue Cube evap cooler. Got the 250 watts, it's running 280 watt fans and 220 watt pumps. Total of 200 watts, but I wanted a little extra for the amps. We got the cold air coming out there. We got the water circulating through the tubes. If you look carefully, you can see a few air bubbles. Sorry, I'm blocking the solar panels so it'll slow down. And there's your unit temps above 60, 15.6 Celsius, 59, 15 Celsius. That's awesome. I just can't believe it. It's staying exactly the same temperature as the water. It couldn't be working better. It's working absolutely awesome. Indirect evap cooling. All right, and then for the install, just go through a window like this. Put the pipes in, one and a quarter inch holes in a one by four, drop it in a window, remove the screen, and then just shut the window down on it or side sliding this way, and you're set. And of course, again, the blue evap outside and the heat exchanger inside. The reason this works is because evap coolers do two things. They cool the air, but they also cool the water down to the same temperature of the air. So when you put like 80 degree Fahrenheit tap water in here and start it up, Turn the fan on, within 10 minutes the water down there will be 60 and it holds solid. And the reason for that is because when the water goes down the pad, maybe 1 or 2 percent of the water evaporates with each pass, but 98 percent of it goes to the bottom and it just literally gets cooled by evaporation itself. So it's cooling the water in the air when you're running this thing. And you might think this thing would overpower it, but it's not even close. This thing totally handles it. That size unit with this size unit worked easily. All right, so it couldn't have worked better. It worked out awesome. So just to wrap it up, if you want to build a system like this, I've got several videos on how to build these, but it's super easy. And then the Blue Cube Evap Cooler, got a couple videos on that too. I'll post all the links to the different videos for this in the uh, description below this video.